their story and listen to them. She was obedient and hardworking, but she dreamt of a handsome prince who would take her away to his castle. One day, while drawing water from the well, a handsome stranger did appear, charmed by Snow White's singing. But White was too shy. introduced themselves. Their names were Sleepy, Grumpy, Happy, Dog, Dopey, Sneezy, and Bashful. They invited Snow White to share their supper. Snow White felt so safe with the dwarves that she decided to stay with them. But the evil queen soon found out that Snow White was still alive. She would have to take matters into her own wicked hands. She fled to a dungeon beneath the castle. There the queen mixed a potion to change her into an old hag. Then she took an apple and dipped it into some poison. 
One bite of this apple and Snow White will close her eyes forever. She cackled. <laughs> the old woman appeared at Snow White's window. Hello, dear, she said. Taste one of my delicious apples. She held the poisoned apple out to Snow White. The birds tried to warn Snow White away from the poisoned fruit. Stop it, stop it, cried Snow White. But it was too late. Snow White took a big bite from the apple and straight away fell to the ground. The animals of the forest ran to the dwarves to warn them that something was very wrong and they needed to come home straight away. The seven dwarves raced to the cottage and found the old woman trying to creep away as Snow White lying lifeless on the floor. The dwarves chased the hag into the forest. A storm began to blow as the evil woman ran away. She came to the edge of a steep and rocky cliff and tried to move a huge rock so it would roll down on top of the poor dwarves and crush them. Look out, cried Grumpy to the others. At that moment, lightning struck. The queen lost her balance and fell to her doom. The sad little dwarves built a bed of gold and glass for their beloved Snow White. They kept watch over her day and night. One day a handsome prince rode into the forest and saw Snow White lying on her bed of glass and gold. How beautiful she was, the prince knelt down and kissed Snow White tenderly. His kiss awakened her. Snow White opened her eyes and immediately fell in love with the prince. He took her in his arms, and together they rode off to his kingdom, where they lived happily ever after. Thank you guys for listening to tonight's story, Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. I hope you can subscribe to my channel, like the video, and leave me a comment. And I will see you next time. Kisses.